does it feel to be here to know that the end is is just so close? Yeah, well, we we still have a lot of work to do, but it is it's something, isn't it? I mean, we've been we've been here for like we're long in the tooth now. We've been here for a while. You guys are a moment in pop culture history forever, basically. It's Good. kind of spectacular. It's great. Yeah, no, I think it'll be one of those shows that when people look back on it, they they look back on it with a fondness that they look at it now that it's on, and I think it will always sort of hold that that place in people's hearts. Is this really the end? Because there's a lot of rumors about a movie, a spinoff. I'm ready for Kevin's Twins to maybe take... <laughs> oh, you yeah, like that Kevin's one. Twins, I like that. All the, well, the reason I laugh, though, is because, you know, working with twin babies is... is they're, they're, they're baby. They just act like babies all day. They do whatever they want, right? They cry, and you have to well, yeah, yell they're cut. Crying, they're crying. If they're not crying, they're not crying. And, you know, you're you're... You're just kind of juggling all day, so that would be an interesting, an interesting show. Would you do more? Would you do a movie in ten years? Yeah, with this crew, with this, with this crew, group of people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course, yeah. Okay. A lot happening for Kevin in season six because season five left us kind of shocked when Madison broke up with Kevin. I know he was shocked. He, he was also shocked. I kind of saw it coming. I was like, yeah, it's, you know, he's, he doesn't even say I love you. He's, he's not, in, you know, he's not in love with her. He's trying to do the right thing. And I just think she that was a very brave thing for her to do, to bow out of something that, I mean, that's, it's not what she wanted. She deserves someone that's in love with her, and, and, um, and so does he, and, and it just, that's not what it was. And so I think it was a really brave thing that she did. How will he pick up the pieces of that in this final season? Will he find love? I hope so. You, you seem skeptical. Do I? No, I don't mean to come off skeptical. I was... I was directing all day, and so I'm in, I've got a, in a different I, my actor face on. No, I hope so. Okay. What about with Sophia? Because we saw we saw Sophie give him a call that seemed to ignite some sort of did, something in him. Yeah, I did for sure. Well, um, there could be something there. I don't know. There could be something there. I do know, but I don't. I don't. I can't say. There might be something there, but there might not be something there. So you don't want to get fans' hopes up because you know we're all hoping for Sophie and Kevin think, to get back I, together. Look, I mean, I, I think that. No one's going to get everything that they want. It's it's that's how shows end, right? It's this compromise, right? And you try to fill as much as you can and be honest to the character without just sort of going, well, this is a fancy little bow and this is a fancy little bow. So we don't do that. But that said, I will say that I think everyone's going to be um, happy with how the show ends. So you do know how it ends. We do, but I hate saying that because then I feel like now people know that, and then I have to I have to make sure that I don't you know, give it away, which I'm really bad at. You are happy with it, and the fans will be satisfied with it. I think so. I hope so. Not every fan, but I, but most of them. I think, you know, 99% of them will be. Okay. Yeah. Who's going to cry the most on that final day of filming? Who's gonna, it'll be, it'll be uh, Chrissy, and it's like, you know, right behind her will be Sterling. That's funny, because that's maybe edging I'm... her out, even. I don't know. It depends. Like, it, down the stretch, they're going to be neck and neck. I'll tell you what. They're very emotional people. She actually said the same thing. She's like, it's going to be me. Why not you? I'm an emotional guy. I just don't, um, I'm not a big crier necessarily, you know? No. How's directing been? Great. I've been loving it. Thanks for asking. It's great. It's wonderful. I mean, I get to direct these people. I was doing a scene with Mandy today, and I, you know, I've watched this woman act for years. I watched her in person for six years. And to see her in that, like, to, to be sitting in that capacity as a director and watching not acting with her, but watching her. I just told her, I said, you're such a beautiful actor. I, I, I mean, the things that she does with her, her body language and her shoulders and her face, I mean, just every, she's like a, she's like a scientist. It's unbelievable. It's, it's unbelievable. And you just feel like, as soon as you call action, you, 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 you see her fill up the, in the entire screen and it's effortless and it's just beautiful. I feel like that's all of you guys. That's the entire cast. That's what makes oh, it so you. special, though. Thank you. Yeah, we try. Yeah, we really love it. Yeah. Who takes direction the best? Is it Mandy? Who takes direction the best? Um, they, I, I hope it's me. Um, I hope it's me. They, they all do. Everyone does. And, and the thing about it is, you know, obviously you're not giving that much direction. They're, they're so tuned into what they're doing. It's more like um, a logistic thing about the frame and all that stuff. So you, I'm not crit critiquing performances necessarily. They're, they're, they're brilliant. How would you describe this final season? What comes to mind? What words? Oh, I think, you know, laughter. The things that kept the show on for so many years and popular for so many years. I think laughter, heart, honesty, um, truth. 
And just the idea that it's um, that things come and go, that everything comes and go, everything comes and then it goes. That's so far. That's how it's been, right? We all we all die, um, so far. So um, so yeah, I, I think those things. You, you say come and go, and then Chrissy mentioned two deaths that we should prepare ourselves for. She did. What what can you tell me about this? No, I'm she concerned. Didn't. There are two deaths. Chrissy. Chrissy. We, we need words. What what is she doing? She's she needs she needs somebody around her. She needs she needs someone to help her. She's not supposed to be talking about that stuff. Is that not true? There are seven, seven deaths. So there's two deaths. Or seven. Who should we prepare ourselves I don't for? Know it's a death. It's like a sprained ankle. It's um, yeah. Who should, downplaying it now? Who should we prepare? Um, should I would we prepare for any amount of death. How should we prepare? I mean, gosh, yeah. I mean, I think maybe. <clears throat> I can't believe she said that. That's great. Uh, I wonder if that's true. I, I think you should be prepared for anything. I hope it's not Kevin. I hope it's not Kevin too. I made it this far. You know, what I mean, I'm, I'm right there. A lot on the right show. There. I'm like that 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 FBI director guy. They got they got fired 24 or uh, 25 hours before he was retiring uh, out of spite. But I but I think that um, I think that I think that I'll make it. We've seen him, you know, in the future, so he'll be okay. Yeah. See him aged up again this season. You wear I the prosthetics so. I, and the I hair. Hope so I think so. Yeah, yeah. We'll see what. Yeah, see if we can get into that a little bit. My favorite Kevin moment was on the football field. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. When he like had that epiphany and and breakdown. Do you have a favorite Kevin moment? That's a pretty good one. I I, I enjoyed that. That was a tough night. Um, but we, we yeah we got through it. Uh, that's a good one. I love the I love when Kevin's romantic. I love when he knocked on Sophie's apartment door and he said he bringing up Sophie say, again. Say three things to her. I love that. Look at you. You were just, you were out of control. Like I'm gonna say bring up Sophie again. Um, yeah, I did, didn't I? Um, and then what else do I? You know, I I love I love the um the, in the pilot the meltdown. I love all the stuff that he does on on the Manny. I think that's great. Yeah, and then um, you know th there's so many. I thought when he went to Randall and his, his opening night and he ditched the play and he went to Randall, and then all the scenes that I have that, that Kevin has with Randall, I think are really important. They talk about a lot of stuff that's that's been sitting there for years, you know. A lot has come up, especially this past season. Especially this past season. What will you miss most about this show and and going to work every day with this amazing cast? The the, the friends, the the cast and crew, the friends that I've made. Yeah. Do you steal anything from set? Any Kevin mementos? Uh, I don't. I don't. I, probably. I don't know. Whatever. Whatever. I can get my grubby little hands on now. I don't think so. I don't think so. I gotta tell you, I'm also a newlywed. So congratulations! congratulations. Oh, congrats! It's great, isn't it? It's so much fun! Oh, congrats! It's wonderful! I love love. I love to hear that. That's so sweet. That's great. How will, how will you guys spend the holidays together? We're gonna be at home. We're gonna be at home. Yeah. We're just gonna chill out at home. We have another week of shooting here, and then. We'll just go home and hang out and stare at each other. What's your husband's name? His name is Jason. Jason. I can't wait to go home and just like I'm be sure. on the couch with him Good and watch, you. you know, This Is Us. Well, that's when you know. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.